at this point you would just need to put on a primer first that would be the first step is to put on a primer um, but I actually don't have a primer at the moment I do have one but I don't want to use it because it broke me out the Tarte clean slate timeless smoothing primer it's a great primer um, for this area but my forehead is a little bit more sensitive so when I use it on my forehead I break out so I'm just not gonna use it all together today because I just got over the breakout from me using it last time. So this time I'm not using a primer. I'm going to jump right into just applying my foundation. Um, for applying my foundation, I'm using the Morphe M426 brush. And this makeup look, makeup tutorial, beginner makeup tutorial, I'm only using three brushes to do the entire look because I want it to be very, um, what is it? cost friendly and easy for those just starting out with makeup so just three brushes and i think they're all gonna be from morphe i'm not sure yet but i really do think they are all gonna be from morphe but the first one is the morphe m426 that i'm using to apply my foundation and i'm using the maybelline matte and poreless foundation this is for normal to oily skin i am the shade 330 or toffee slash caramel Now I'm going to highlight, um, I'm using the LA Girl Pro Concealer in the shade Creamy Beige. And um, because we're only using three brushes, I'm going to blend this out with my finger. So you want to apply the concealer under your eyes, on your nose, and on your chin, and a little bit on your forehead. All right, now we're gonna go back in with the same brush we used for our foundation and go directly on top of the concealer just to blend it out even more. Next, I'm going to use one of my favorite setting powders and this is the Airspun Loose Face Powder in the shade Naturally Neutral. And we're gonna take the exact same foundation brush and dust a little bit of this on all of the places that we just put the concealer on or in or whatever. All right, then after that, we're going to go in with a little bronzer. My favorite bronzer, the NYX, well, one of my favorite bronzers, the NYX Matte Bronzer in the shade Dark Tan. This is just going to bring life back into our face um, because when we put on the foundation, it kind of made everything blank. So we're going back in with that exact same brush that we've been using and bronze up. All right, now we're gonna go in and prime our eyelids with the Urban Decay Primer Potion just to get ready for the eyeshadows we're gonna use. First, we're going into the Morphe 35N palette. They have a lot of good transition area shades in here. So the first shade I'm using is um, this shade right here. And I'm going to begin the second brush that I plan on using, which is the Morphe M441 brush. And this is a blending brush. And we're going to place this in the transition. Now for the lid shade, I'm using the Morphe 12S palette with this shade right here on the third and final brush that I plan on using in this video. And that is the Morphe M224 brush. All right, and for the waterline, I'm using the LA Girl Brown Gel Pencil Liner. All right, no lashes today. We're just going to put on a little mascara, and this is the Perversion Mascara by Urban Decay Cosmetics. All right, with the same Morphe 12S palette, I'm using the shade right above the shade we used on our lid, which is this one, with the same brush that we used to put on our lid shade, which is the Morphe 224. And I'm just gonna use this as my highlighter, so I'm placing this on the highlighter points on my face and then I'm gonna blend it out with my finger all right that is the end of my beginner makeup tutorial with only three brushes I hope this video was helpful for you guys that are just starting wearing makeup I tried to make it as easy as possible and not using all of the steps that I normally would um, with a full face full glam of makeup so thank you guys so so much for watching make sure you subscribe to keep yourself updated on my new videos and I promise I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys.